A winged blood collection set allows for a lower angle of insertion, greater control, and easier maneuverability. However, using them on every patient may not be appropriate because they're often associated with a higher accidental needle stick rate when improperly discarded and a higher cost per use compared to other devices. Therefore, choose winged collection sets only when circumstances require them. Examples include when blood cultures are ordered in addition to other laboratory tests or coupled with a syringe on small or fragile veins where needle placement and control are critical to the success of the puncture. Select and cleanse the site. If using with a tube holder, assemble the device and perform the puncture as usual. If possible, release the tourniquet upon venous access to minimize the effects of hemoconcentration. If drawing blood cultures, apply the tube holder assembly to the aerobic vial first, followed by the anaerobic vial if included in the set. After filling the blood culture tubes or vials, fill the other tubes in the prescribed order of draw. If using a syringe with a winged collection set, select and cleanse the site as usual. Assemble the device, break the seal of the plunger, and expel the air from the syringe by advancing it fully forward. Perform the puncture and withdraw the plunger until the appropriate volume of blood has been obtained. Release the tourniquet and place a clean gauze pad over the insertion site. Remove the needle and apply pressure, immediately activating the needle's safety feature according to manufacturer's instructions. Remove the set from the syringe and attach a safety transfer device. Discard the set according to OSHA guidelines and your facility's policy. Fill the tubes in the correct order of draw, inverting each tube after filling.